Hey people, it's Mike here, voice of the Christian left, also Center for Fiscal Equity. Um, here's a tip for you. Right now, sell your Bitcoin, short oil. President Biden said in his State of the Union address that um, he was going to re-regulate, you know, undo all those things that, that Trump did. Um, Trump promised, uh, or... You know, Trump put Mick Mulvaney in at OMB, and when he did so, he also put Mulvaney in charge of um, the Consumer Financial Protection Authority, which um, you can tell it was deregulated because the prices went up. Um, so those reforms are about to come back. You know, Biden promised it in the State of the Union. So if you want to make a lot of money right now, sell your Bitcoin. Which is going to crash anyway. Sell it now. It's as high as it's going to get. Um... And short oil. You short oil, you go from being a Bitcoin millionaire to a real billionaire. So, um, you know, I don't have any money, so I can't short it. But if you want, but, you know, if this helped you, support this channel. Uh, like and subscribe. So, um, and, you know, and share the wealth. So, become a Patreon. Um, but, but, you know, pass this around to your friends. Don't show your enemies. Because, you know. It's it's close to a sure thing because you know when the when the when everybody's bidding up, it's time to bid down. So yeah, short oil, sell Bitcoin, short oil, because Joe's going to change the marketplace at NYMEX, and when he does, you know people are going to be selling all their other stuff to cover those futures contracts, and when they have to do that, you know it's going to be mortgage-backed securities they sell, so sell those too. Sell your boundaries to back securities, sell your Bitcoin, and then, you know, and a short oil. Um, so, yeah, that's, again, you know, you remember the big short? Well, it's happening again. That started with oil, and then after, and then they had, the, you know, then the people who shorted uh, CDOs made lots of money. They made $2 billion. You know, see the big short if you have any doubts about how that works. Uh, and they didn't point out, though, that... You can look at the a 60 Minutes pro, um, episode from when the when the oil prices were high back in back in 2007 2008. Um, Google it. Um, the big banks were the ones who were buying futures. You know, it was financial firms. It wasn't people who actually buy and sell oil. So the same people are doing the same thing, um, except the smart ones are getting out. Uh, they learned their lesson. So, you know, the the common people are now buying futures contracts. Don't do that. Don't do that. Um, instead, short oil. If you got money, short oil. Um, sell mortgage-backed securities. Anything that people who are who, ha who are going to who are buying oil now, whatever they have in reserve, whatever they have in reserve, there's going to be a run on that. Um, so let's say I've got a, f a futures contract that's tied to whatever it takes per barrel to to, to get. Um, to have a, to assume five and six dollar gasoline, and that you know that if those people have you know backup money, they all everybody always does. So um, whatever that backup money is, is going to be going down when they have to cover those contracts. When the people ha have oil contracts for six dollars, uh, you know whatever the, the, the per barrel cost is, they've got to make that up. So they have to sell their other stuff. So if if don't have that other stuff because it's going to go down. Uh, you can short that too if you want. You know, I don't know what's in um, in um, the major, you know, what's in Goldman Sachs's portfolio uh, or whoever's whoever the big traders are. But you know, whatever they have, sell it because it's going to go down. You can short it too, um, but definitely short oil. Make a lot of money. Uh, again, if I had money, you know, I'd be buying, I'd be sell doing puts right and left. But you know. Uh, again, if I made you rich today, send me some money. Uh, <laughs> thank you much. Have a pleasant, pleasant day. How do I, here we go.